again welcome back to my channel if you are new don't forget to like subscribe and leave a comment below so today we are going to do a tinted moisturizer comparison so i have the raw beauty tinted moisturizer right here let's see it and i also have studio makeup face moisturizer so we're going to try both of them one on each side and see the difference the first one we're going to try is the Rare Beauty. This is what it looks like when you open it. It's one of my favorite tinted moisturizers so far. And I love how it lets you apply it as well. Then I'll start by adding some into the face. So we're going to do the right side, the tinted moisturizer. So as you guys know what tinted moisturizers are, it's basically you're applying foundation, but it's not foundation. It's like a tinted moisturizer. So it kind of helps you out, giving you all the sunscreen that you need, the moisturizing that you need. It also has a color foundation to it. So it's like having foundation on, but not foundation. So we're just going to do the right face a little bit more to blend it in. side with the moisturizer we're gonna blend that in You guys see a difference? So I have no foundation, nothing on this side at all. So this is my natural skin. So the difference between this and here. Basically the moisturizer is something you could just put on and then it still give you the aesthetic of you wearing the foundation but you're not really wearing one. So it's a light coverage. studio makeup what I like about the rare tinted moisturizer is the positive light tinted moisturizer like I said it has the sunscreens on it and then the packaging is also very cute alright the next side now the packaging of this one not so much I'm not a big fan of this one but this is like also my first time trying to use this so we're gonna give it a try. I don't think this is gonna be my shade, but it doesn't really matter. It's just me trying it out right now. So eventually I'll just get my shade if I really like it. But this is just to see the coverage, how it turns out, etc. etc. So this is what it look like. Now we're gonna blend it in and see the difference on each side. This is definitely not my shoe, it's a bit dark, but it's okay, we can work with that. Right off the bat, what I notice is, the Red Beauty does feel like more of a moisturizer, this feels more like a foundation. I know it's supposed to be a tinted moisturizer, but I'm getting a lot like foundation to this. I 
Thank you guys for your guys. Rare beauty and this uh, what do you guys think is the best so far? You see how like this one looks very shiny and oily? So that's like foundation vibes and you guys can see where the rare beauty is, it's not as shiny and oily. Keep blending in when I think it's better. I'm just gonna take a look at it myself. All right, y'all, what do you guys think? Rare beauty or this? Uh, Studio makeup, tinted moisturizer, or the Rare Beauty. Overall, I do prefer the Rare Beauty, like I said, because it's a tinted moisturizer. I want to feel like I didn't put no foundation on, and then it's just to give me enough coverage if I want to go do errands and stuff. But with the Photo Studio, it's definitely like heavy. You could, you feel like there's something there that like there's moisturizer, but you also feel like it's foundation, like but overall coverage wise on both sides they do have a lot of coverage you guys can't even see my like my dark spots as much so it does a good job at covering but this side is definitely not my shade at all Thank you for watching guys this is it for this video if you guys do prefer the rare beauty let me know in the comments below which one do you guys prefer overall or which one do you guys think did better and i'll see you guys on the next one